Roger Steven. Just give me a chance. Sorry, son. I'm saving your life. General Patton has said that wars are fought with weapons, but they're won by men. I think he's full of crap. Case in point. Yeah, who won that war? It was me. Yeah, I know this neighborhood. I got beat up in that alley. You just don't know when to give up, do you? I could do this all day. Do you have something against running away? You start running away and they never let you stop. Our goal is to create the greatest army in history. You and you. Tell me what you got. New goal. Let's not die. Five tries in five different cities. I can offer you a chance. When you brought a 90 pound asthmatic wig with no friends who sucks into my army base, I'll let it slide. I was looking for qualities beyond the physical. You win Morris with guts. Take grenade! Everybody down! He still sucks. Why me? Because the wicked man knows the value of strength, the value of power. In the box. This isn't so bad. You haven't done anything yet. I'm back. Wolf. How do you feel? Taller. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Your task won't be simple. Your enemy is not what you expect. This is why we have given you the suit. Your suit is capable of many functions. The straps are for strapping. The star represents what a star you are. The air for America represents America. Kid, this proves I'm stronger than you. You could call me Captain America. Captain? I don't think so. You're just a private. All right, okay. Lieutenant America. Ugh. Come on, don't you think I deserve a promotion for doing all this? No. Please? Fine. Private 2. I don't think it works. <laughs> no. <laughs> what do you mean? You don't really seem very much taller. Yeah, I just measured myself. <laughs> well... I grew three inches. You don't look like it. Oh, well... Sorry. Don't I look more muscular? <laughs> Uh, yeah? No? Yeah, right? Well, a little bit. <laughs> Thank you.